Hello everyone, once again back to Bullet to the channel. A lot of uh, people asking for part 12 of the series how to create a city in Blender 2.8. So here we are with a related video, but uh, as we are moving on, a lot of things have changed. Uh, so today I will show you how to import from Google Maps the exact terrain and buildings using GIS add on. Let's start by downloading the add on. Uh, I will put the link into the description. So for me, I have already downloaded. Uh, please don't unzip the file. And now from Blender, go to Edit Preferences. From Add-on Start, click Install. Select the zip file on your local. And as you can see here, all modules uh, installed. And now check Blender GIS. And one more thing to set is the cache folder. I will choose desktop. So yeah, it is. And now close the pop-up window. Now I will double tap A uh, to select everything. Press H to hide everything. Zero from the numpad to exit the camera view. And Shift and S cursor toward origin. I will press 7 on the numpad to go to top view. And from here, as you can see, GIS has now a new tab here. I will uh, select web geodata and click on base map. So from here, we have the source. So you can see we have Google, OSM, Bing, and OSM WMS and the layer is satellite or map. I will leave the default settings and press OK. What map here? From uh, NumPad, you press uh, plus to zoom and minus to unzoom. And now, uh, we can press NG on the keyboard and search for a town, country, whatever you like. So I will type here New York and the zoom level, I will set it to, let's say, 16. As you can see, center of uh, New York and detail level to 16. I would like to zoom a little bit out, so I will press the minus uh, on the numpad and from here with uh, shift and uh, scroll down you can position the map wherever you like I will press uh, plus one more time to zoom in I will like this part now press E to export and as you can see, it is exported as a plane here. This is uh, completely flat. Now press uh, 7, top view again. And having selected the, the plane here, go again to GIS, Web Data, and get SRTM. This will give uh, a bump to the actual uh, map. As you can see here, it gives a little bump to the map. And now we'll press 7 again to go to top view. Everything has to be from top view. And go to web and join data again and get OSM. This will fetch the buildings from Google Maps to our plane. So press get OSM. And from here, uh, I will uh, leave the default uh, at this ways. And uh, you can uh, press a shift to select everything here. And uh, don't forget to check also elevation from uh, object and leave the default elevation here. So for me, I will select uh, from building until uh, natural. 
because uh, the other two are just some uh, curves and from uh, here you can check separate objects um, but it will take more uh, time to import that uh, but this is, depends uh, from the ethernet cable and speed so press ok and we are going to wait the objects to be imported as you can see everything is uh, now imported and all the buildings are now in place so if we press on top view you can see that uh, all the buildings are in position but a lot of things are extra like these uh, lines here so I will uh, press X and delete and fortunately I will delete everything that is extra for me so I will hide all the buildings, hide the plane as you can see some other buildings are different so I will hide all, also this now these are just some flat planes that we don't need so I will also delete everything else by selecting everything and X delete so Alt and H to unhide and now we we'll select everything press tab go to edit uh, press uh, Z on the keyboard wireframe and I will also delete some extra polygons that I don't need X delete faces press tab once again to go back to solid and from Z to solid here as you can see here now everything is more clear and now we'll hide the buildings and select the plane go to top view and press tab to go to, to edit and I will press K for knife and I will just remove the ocean from the plane so just go around and press enter at the end so select police select the ocean x and delete face press tab and now we are back to object mode so ocean is removed alt h to hide the buildings and as you can see this is uh, much more clear and now shift and a mesh play scale with s scale by 20 let's say go on top g to move or somewhere here and this will be our ocean as you can see here i just uh, position a little bit the ocean to the z-axis and choose the color from the plane and just changing it a little bit to match the color of the ocean so as you can see it's a really fast uh, method to import a lot of buildings and 
I go to edit on the buildings, you can just start uh, shaping the buildings or add some loops to create uh, some windows, let's say. Yeah. As you can see now, you can edit everything that is on the map. Some uh, buildings have more details than others. As you can see, this one has uh, some more detail. And also you can delete the unnecessary uh, parts like this one, the bridge uh, columns. So I will press X, faces, and delete also this. So this is the end of the video. I hope you liked it. And uh, from the next uh, video, we are going to continue uh, this series. So let's stay tuned and please don't forget to like and subscribe.